Just has identified two of the collector's cars likely to have kill switch tech. We'll have to decide which one we want to boost. They're both gold-bladed monstrosities. First one is a Mercedes G63. He's moved it to a house casino downtown for Fortune Valley Day. Getting it down is not gonna be easy. And the second target? The collector's flying the second one out to Japan tomorrow. It'll be on display near the Rift VIP terminal. He's gonna have that place sewn up. So, which one do we grab? We want to piss off the collector, right? I say we grab them both. All right, Mac. Let's give it a shot. The fireworks for Fortune Valley Day will start any minute. We have to get there while it's still going. It'll be all the distraction we need. Remind me, why is Tyler the one driving the Mac attack? You wanted to drive the Mercedes, right? It's either that or the truck. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's just <laughs> Tyler. If you hurt my baby, I swear. Your baby? I've seen you T-bone Rex for fun with that thing. That's different. Rap, we're good to go with the car security, right? Yes. I reverse engineered the Koenigsegg ECU code into an unlocked broadcaster that will work for any car with a compatible modification and uploaded it to your mobile phones. English, please. There's an app for that. Uh, Jess? Fireworks started. Already? Mac, you said there'd be plenty of time. This is the last time I let you plan a job. Couldn't account for traffic, Jess. Now step on it. second car. Shake off the cops. 
So, Rav, how are those kill switches looking? The G-Wagon has a kill switch, all right. The Lambo has, uh, something else. A self-driving system. I'm talking artificial intelligence, or the next closest thing. The parts share design elements with the Koenigsegg tech as well. 